Okay, so I quickly wanted to make a two month post-op video and I was doing them weekly. I think I stopped at week four or week five and I'm picking it up, uh, I'm picking it back up again. And right now I am in my truck and forgive me if there's a lot of noise due to the AC or the truck uh, or whatnot. Uh, I am outside of campus and I just got out of some classes and I took a shower and stuff. But uh, it's been a really good recovery. So first thing I wanna talk about is, uh, well, before I get into that, I don't wanna make this video too long, but basically uh, I went to my, with my orthodontist. So I think last time in the last video I had mentioned that I missed uh, the two appointments or whatever. And I guess I got them rescheduled and I think I'm all good now, hopefully. But I saw my orthodontist about a week ago uh, to, he's a specialist that I think he comes out of state or something. I'm not really sure what the whole situation is, but uh, he ended up putting a wire on the top of my teeth. So you can see the wire there. And on the bottom, there's still some brackets, some brackets missing. And he told me that next time he sees me, he wants to spend more time with me. Uh, surely enough, he will put those brackets on and probably the bottom wire. So that is what I'm hoping for. And yeah, I am very happy. I'm really excited and it's been a really good recovery process. And as you can see, my face has probably transformed a little more since the last video that I've made. And I'm not sure if you can notice my uh, lisp still. Um, I kind of hear it in my head, but... I think I've had a cousin, a cousin that told me that he couldn't really notice it uh, anymore. So that is really exciting as well. And of course, uh, I'm gonna show my smile real quick. So actually, looks really good. Um, looks a lot better than other times where I've showed my teeth. I haven't really been paying a whole lot of attention to them since I've been really busy doing whatnot, dealing with life and stuff the last few weeks. But yeah, it's been really good. Uh, I, I asked the orthodontist about why my teeth on the bottom row were sort of loose or whatever. And he told me, uh, he, he practically brushed it off. So he didn't really talk too much about it and maybe it had to do with uh maybe he was on a time constraint or something because i didn't spend long in there he just put the wire in and of course the the little rubber rubber band a row on the top as well i guess to secure it i'm not really sure how that works but yeah uh but i will be seeing my uh i will be seeing a dentist tomorrow i have an appointment for a dentist and maybe they can better explain to me why I still feel movement. Because I noticed over the last two months now that it's not just my bottom three or four teeth that move. Uh, and it, it's it's some other teeth as well, like in the back. The, the, the canine teeth. I don't know what they call them, but I guess the corner teeth here and here. Uh, if I like grasp them with my two fingers and I kind of just not with the whole ton of force but if I move them back and forth they definitely do move but I don't think uh it's I don't think it's that big a deal I'm not really worrying about it worrying about it right now because I, I feel like I, I felt improvements like they're not I don't know if it's all in my head but it feels like they're not shifting or moving as much as they used to and, and hopefully that's the case. And I mean, when I'm eating food and stuff, like if I bite down on a pizza, a burger, uh, uh, anything like that, I'm trying to get give some better examples or I don't know, just foods that you have to like really get in there to use all your teeth. I mean, I can I can pretty much do that without feeling any pain, really. I mean, I can chew down pretty well. I have some, I have like a really big ulcer back here inside. I'm not sure if that's been open since the beginning or if I'm just starting to feel that area and now I feel the pain in there. I'm not really sure when that was there, but it feels like a pretty big ulcer. I think I took a picture, I tried to get a really good picture. I might put it in here just to show you what I'm talking about. 
I think it looked really like red and uh, but I feel like that will subside over time it's probably just like a just a typical like uh, like ulcer I would say or minor cut or I don't know what it is or how it got there or if it was there from the beginning but that's there and it's really annoying because when I get food stuck back there in the corner like if I get it in the wrong position it, it hurts me uh, there or when I'm brushing my teeth maybe the toothbrush goes too far back and I hit the ulcer area and that's really annoying because it hurts it stings momentarily and then it just goes away but yeah that's there that's annoying but everything else is in pretty good I guess you can take a look at how wide that can open and as I'm doing that I feel the the pain in the the ulcer that I'm talking about Yeah, I could pretty much open up all the way as, as I used to be able to. I'll try to get you guys a side profile in here. Let's see if I can do it. Go there and take this side right here. So, there is my face. And... Yeah, my jaw and everything. Everything feels really good. It's working out pretty well. I need to ask if I still need to need to, uh, I need to ask if I still need to be seeing the surgeon uh, that I was having appointments with uh, on a weekly basis at the beginning. But that gap was widening to like every two weeks or every three weeks, and now I haven't gotten an appointment set up with the surgeon. So who knows? If I'll have to meet with them again, but I'll need to inform myself about that. But yeah, I just wanted to do this uh, quick update, two-month post-op video. And yeah, this is pretty much off the cuff. I didn't prepare anything. Uh, I'm just going uh, with the most important details. And yeah, that's about it. Uh, definitely going to want to post some gaming content and stuff like that because i like doing that stuff but yeah thank you guys for watching and i will see you in the next video